Good day everybody, Michael Posnick here, Century 21 Northumberland, your high definition real estate agent. Coming to you live from what used to be the Heritage Pub, and then later changed into the Rock and Rodeo Bar. In addition, I think they had a car detailing place here. We're located right on Water Street, uh, almost two acres and 15,000 square feet with too many upgrades to even mention on this, but it is on the cut sheet. Unfortunately, the business is now closed. So uh, our office is now in charge of liquidating the asset. So let's go take a look. So we've got an outdoor area there. This would be the restaurant area, the main entrance. That would be the uh, coat closet. And then there's also offices upstairs, additional space, and then a garage like set up to the right through that white door. Obviously tons of parking and lots of different operations or businesses you could run out of this location. Here's a quick view of the back with the Ford dealer in the left half of the frame, speedy glass, and the rear of our subject property, the main road on Water Street. Here's a final view of the back of the property if our camera doesn't shut down on us. And looking to the west towards Staples. We're gonna try to get through this real quick. So there's the coat room. This is the main entrance. Stairs that lead upstairs. You've got the dining area the left, and you've got this giant, ginormous safe to the right. So this would be the main dining area with exposure to Water Street. This is an elevated dining area that faces west. And then we have the double bars there, an additional interior dining space. I'm standing atop of the uh, DJ booth, which is in the corner of the dance area. There's your double bars. That would be the main entrance on Water Street with a large door opening to the outdoor uh, patio. Dance area, lots of tables, stage. Of course, additional seating all the way along that wall. Just behind the DJ booth is uh, the back entrance to the kitchen. Looks like we've got some geothermal systems happening here that are fairly new. Walking through that room, we have an additional storage room right here, which leads to the kitchen to the right through that door. This is the rather large kitchen area. There's a cold room just to the left there. We've got doors that uh, open to the back, east side. Preparation table, sinks. And we've got two, three entrances and exits, two of which are in front of me. One goes to the dining room, one goes to the front entrance. This one goes to the dining room. We just came up these rather grand stairs behind the cashier area that bring us to this area here, which looks like a food prep area, maybe a secondary bar area. And then there's uh, several offices, one through this door to the right. Here's one of the offices overlooking Water Street, and then there's a similar one on the other end. This would be your technical room, audio, video, telephone, internet, geothermal systems. Many upgrades and renovations that have been done to this building. This is the back exit from that room, which brings us to the other part of the building. This is the last part of the building, which could be used for car detailing, uh, some sort of automotive service, or just about anything else. This area has its own front entrance and double doors right here for retail exposure on Water Street. That concludes my coverage of 35 Water Street here in Summerside. Thank you very much for watching my video. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel on YouTube at michaelshomeshd.com and my weekly newsletter with PEI real estate tips, tricks, and traps at michaelshomes.com. Thank you, have a great day, and remember to buy it right.